The flat size of other printed items like pocket folders depends on the design being used. A standard 9 inch by 12 inch pocket folder with two 4 inch pockets has a 9 inch by 12 inch finish size. When opened and laid flat for printing, it would have a flat size of 18 inches by 16 inches plus the width of the glue tabs necessary to glue the pockets. If each glue tab is 1 inch wide, the flat size of the pocket folder becomes 20 inches by 16 inches. Knowing this allows production to, ter to determine the layout for printing, how many folders can print on each press sheet, and what size sh press sheets must be used. Here are some examples of flat sizes. You need to take into consideration how the object or the item that you were designing will look when it is fully bound and is manufactured and complete versus how it will look when it is folded flat. We can take some things into consideration. For example, we can make sure that like things print on the same side of a sheet of paper. If you look at the example on the bottom in the middle here, we have a trifold or a letter fold brochure. If I wanted to eliminate the color green and I only wanted to use the spot green color on one side, I would have to make sure that I designed all of the green artwork on the three panels that you can see and if you flip the brochure to the other side, I wouldn't use a spot green color because I don't want to play for that on the other side of my printing plate. When you're using a flat size for producing non-traditional things like packaging and boxes and things like that, envelopes, you have to take into consideration that an envelope, for example, might be five inches by seven inches but I can't assume that it only takes up five inches by seven inches on a press sheet because I have to have flaps that fold in to create the envelope. The same thing happens when you're working on maps and trifolds and different panels. The flat size is important because you need to know how much real estate it takes up on your press sheet because then you can account for that. Functionality wise, you wanna make sure that your item actually fits on a press sheet. If the widest sheet that you can print on is 40 inches and you design something that's 48 inches long, you're going to have a really hard time finding someone who's able to print it.